Bangud, officially the municipality of Bangud, Ilocano, Ilit Bangud, Tagalog, Bayan ng Bangud, is a first-class municipality and capital of the province of Abra, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 48,163 people. History The name, Bangud, means, roadblock. It was established as a regular town in 1598 and was made the seat of the provincial government of Abra on July 25, 1861. The inauguration coincided with the feast day of St. James the Great. The early settlers were the Tinguians belonging to the Bago, Itneg, Masadip, El Banao, and Indias tribes, who later intermarried with the immigrants from Ilocos Sur. The Tinguians opposed the Christianization introduced by the Spanish friars who penetrated the eastern settlements. The Tinguian residents prevented the Spaniards from penetrating their area of which they placed roadblocks on all roads leading to the place. They also cut large logs and threw them to the Abra River to prevent the incoming colonizers from entering the area with the use of their boats and bamboo rafts. These logs were made as obstacles and big rocks were placed along the roads which the natives called Bangan meaning obstacles. When the conquistadores, led by Juan de Salcedo, decided to penetrate the area, they proceeded eastward and saw for themselves the logs along the Abra River, and the stones placed there to block all roads leading to the community. Salcedo's subaltern happened to meet one of the natives and asked what was the name of the place. Thinking that the Spaniards were inquiring about the roadblocks, he answered, Bangan, and the subaltern jotted down on his notebook about the word. The Spaniards were successful in their attempt to penetrate the inner communities in the east by removing the obstacles, saying in Spanish, Abra esos obstaculos, and it was in that happening when they developed the area and established the towns and barangays. The place where they found many obstacles, they named it Bangan, and the province they called it Abra. When the Americans colonized the country and established the civil government, the town's name was modified to Bangud. In 1692, Augustinians under Fray Colombo made Bangud an independent mission territory. Earlier in 1615, Juan Pareja organized Bangud as a mission center and baptized 3,000 Tinguians with the help of their chief, Manuel Dumawa. Modern-day Bangud was formally organized in 1704 until it was decided to become the capital town of Abra in 1863. It has 31 barangays, seven of them in the town proper. Conversion to cityhood Cityhood for Bangud is being given a push in the 16th Congress. Abra representative Ma. Jocelyn Bernos filed a resolution seeking congressional nod for the capital town cityhood. Geography Bangud is a landlocked municipality, located at 17 degrees 36 and 120 degrees 37 e. It is elongated in shape towards the north and south, and bisected through the center by the large Abra River. It is situated in the western portion of the province with boundaries defined by the province of Ilocos Norte and the municipality of Danglas in the north, La Paz, Tayam and Penarubia in the east, San Isidro in the south, and Languedan and Pitigan in the west. According to the Philippine Statistics Authority, the municipality has a land area of 105.70 square kilometers, 40.81 square miles, constituting 2.54% of the 4,165.25 square kilometer, 1,608.21 square miles total area of Abra. The town is generally mountainous from north to south. However, it is flat and rolling at the midsection. From here it has an elevation of 30 meters 98 feet above mean sea level. In the north, which consists mostly of mountains, elevation ranges from 60 to 1,036 meters 197 to 3,399 feet. In the south, which is interspersed with mountain and hills, elevation ranges from 45 to 300 meters 148 to 984 feet. One such hill is Casamata Hill which was declared a national park. Bangud is accessible through the Abra Ilocos Sur National Road from the west, Abra Kalinga Road from the northeast, and Abra Ilocos Norte Road from the north. 
It is 408 kilometers, 254 miles from Manila, 196 kilometers, 122 miles from Baguio and 65 kilometers, 40 miles from Bigan. Climate The climate falls under the first type of tropical climate, which is characterized by two pronounced seasons, dry from November to April and wet during the remaining months of the year. Prevailing wind blowing in the area is mostly in the direction from northwest to southeast. However, during summer in the absence of weather disturbance, wind blows from north to south or east to west. Barangays Bangud is politically subdivided into 31 barangays with 77 sitios. Demographics In the 2015 census, Bangud had a population of 48,163. The population density was 460 inhabitants per square kilometer, 1,200 per square miles. Economy The economy of the municipality is heavily dependent on agriculture particularly Pele and corn, followed by trade and industry. Chinese businessmen dominate trade and manufacturing as a common preoccupation of the populace. The commercial activity of Bangud is confined in the urban core establishing a linear pattern of development along major thoroughfares. This is evident from Torrijos Street to Taft Street of Zone 5, McKinley Street to Santiago Street and Partelo Street of Zone 4, and Capitulacion Street of Zone 1 and Zone 2. For the year 2000 there were 1,539 commercial business enterprises classified as wholesale and retail trade, dry and wet markets, banking and finance, service and others. There were nine large suppliers of lumber, hardware and other construction supplies and materials. Likewise there were also about three large contractors with undetermined number of small to medium scale. On the other hand, there were also a number of large to medium scale suppliers of general merchandise, groceries and various types of prime commodities. As the economic center of Abra, small scale or cottage industries abound. The most common are hollow blocks and other concrete products manufacturing with gravel and sand readily available at the Abra River Bank. Wood and bamboo craft are also promising business enterprises with raw materials available in the vicinity and in the hinterlands for nara and other species of hardwood, rattan, and bamboos. Metalcraft, tinsmithing, jewelry making is also expanding while a lot of households are now in the small-scale processing or value-adding activities appertaining to various food items. Hospitals and clinics education The municipality has a total of 24 educational institutions at all levels. 21 belong to the government while the rest are private. Of the total public schools, 19 belongs to the elementary levels. Most of the educational institutions of higher levels secondary and tertiary are concentrated in the urban core, while elementary schools are strategically located in different barangays forming their own catchment areas. Aside from these institutions there are at least 15 daycare centers located in different barangays, and five private institutions for preschoolers complementing that from the government. The total number of elementary school teachers in the public sector is 218 giving a gross teacher-pupil ratio of 130 in the private there are 193 with a ratio of 128 in the same period. Two public libraries complement existing facilities, the Provincial Library located Al Santiago Street Zone 3 and the Integrated Bar of the Philippines Library located at the Municipal Trial Court. Colleges Divine Word College of Bangud, Zone 6 Private Abra Valley Colleges, Zone 4 Semi-private Data Center College of the Phils, Zone 5 Private Abra State Institute of Sciences and Technology, Zone 3 Public High Schools Transportation Passenger buses, mini buses, jeepneys and tricycles including cargo are the major means of transportation in the town. Buses, mini buses and jeepneys ply the longer routes covering the entire province of Abra and out, while tricycles serve only the inner arteries of the municipality's barangays including the adjacent towns of Pitigan, Tayam and Penarubia on a chartered ride basis. Buses going to Manila have their own permanent stationed terminal, while all the rest are accommodated and parked along various open lots, gasoline stations, etc. 
There are jeeps that ply from Bangud to Narvacan. GMW Trans have daily trips to Teguegarao and Santiago City. Sister cities Vegan References External links Official website of the Municipal Government of Bangud